The thing about cycling is like you've got such high moments and low moments. The amount of, of different emotions you feel when you feel it with the same people, you know, it's, it's something that can't be replicated is what makes cycling so special. I'm absolutely ready. It's like I never trained so hard before. We all know it's like uh, Olympic Games in London for a British team. That's like probably the biggest thing. The Spring Classics are huge for me. Uh, it's part of the season that I really enjoy, I really like. And you know, the Belgium and French crowds are crazy for it, so it's just great to be there. Just racing on the cobbles, the unpredictable weather. It's just a lot more about physical ability, and uh, yeah, it's just amazing. For me, the Classics are important, like also for the team. The Giro Italia is important. Welcome to modern cycling, every race is important. It's been the hardest winter I've done ever and um, you know it's all with one goal in mind and trying to be as good as possible in July. Big big hits really are um, San Remo, uh, Ghent Weather again, um, you know and then rolling on to to the Tour and the Olympics so I mean obviously we're going to target um, the Giro as well for stage wins is going to be the main thing uh, early on because I just think that final week is really quite tough. The Tour and Olympics will be will be a big hit. The question I get asked a lot, do you enjoy climbs? I do enjoy climbing, you know. Um, well, in training I do, racing not so much, but neither do the guys who are going fast up them. Everybody's suffering on a climb. Um, it's probably more important I train for climbing than I do for, for sprinting, because where sprinting comes quite naturally, climbing, that, that, that's where the races are won or lost. Really. The big ones to, to get into the tour team and you know, support Bradley, I guess. But uh, you know, then I look at races like Romandy and Paris Nice, and I mean, it's it's an exciting season. It's always been my my goal to to be, develop into a, a GC rider, and I think the Vuelta last year showed that it, it is something that's that's within my reach. It's not just some far off dream. The, the feeling is amongst the rider group that you know we're on the edge of something brilliant you know it's it's a solid rider group and um, you know it's quite a tight-knit little team <laughs>